Good morning. I'm Brian Reagan. This is Tyler Kelly. And we welcome you to Mornings with Brian and Tyler. Today we're in Proverbs 1, 29 through 33. Tyler. Because they hated knowledge and did not choose the fear of the Lord, would have none of my counsel and despised all my reproof. Therefore they shall eat the fruit of their way and be sated with their own devices. For waywardness kills the simple and the complacency of fools destroys them. But those who listen to me will be secure and will live at ease without dread or of disaster. All right. So what the because they hated knowledge and did not choose the fear of the Lord goes back to the statement, they will call upon me, but I will not answer. They will seek me diligently, but they will not find me. Because why? Because they would not have the reproof of wisdom. If you spend your entire life um, being lazy and eating 10,000 calories more a day than what you burn, there's going to come a time when you can't get out of bed. You say, oh, don't be that way. Yeah, no. That then when you're 95, and and uh, and we've we've seen these cases documented, you know, someone's like you know four hundred ninety eight pounds, and they're five foot tall. How do you get that weight back down? How do you get the muscles strengthened so that they can walk again? That's kind of what wisdom is saying here. There comes a tipping point. There comes a tipping point. And what I'm going to say to you is, if you're listening right now, you're not at that tipping point. Now, some of you might be close. But if you'll repent now, if you'll get on board with wisdom as we start going through this, and you'll start making the changes whether you like them or not, you can turn this tide still. He said, well, what if I'm not even close to that tipping point? Then take advantage of her reproof and get better. Get better. Mm -hmm. um, because verse 33, those who listen to me will be secure and will live at ease without dread of disaster. I don't know what, what is coming this year. All I know is if we get our stuff straightened out by the book of Proverbs, now some of us, you know, maybe we should have been better in setting aside savings or something. I don't know, Tyler. I don't know if you've got an entire year's worth of savings set up or not. I don't know. Proverbs would have told us 25, 30 years ago what? Start getting that stuff set aside. But you can start saving now. What if you only have a thousand dollars? A thousand dollars saved is better than zero. Start now. Start heeding wisdom now. You have some other thoughts? No, sir. All right. I'm Brian Reagan. This is Tyler Kelly. We bid you good morning, Lord willing. We'll see you back at 1230 for our midday meditation. Want to invite you though, come back tonight at seven o'clock. Brother Ronnie Keller bringing his lessons on the book of James, live stream or in person, Lake Butler Church of Christ.